Edward the Blue Engine is one of the oldest engines on the Fat Controllers Railway, but he's been getting slower and weaker. Some engines think this makes him unreliable. Edward's so slow and out of date, said James one morning. He should be replaced. Thomas was cross. James, Edward's more reliable than you will ever be. Ha! Huh, James scoffed. The old timer needs to be replaced urgently. He's so slow and out of date. Henry agreed with him. Just you wait, James, said Thomas. Edward will prove you wrong. But James just scoffed and rolled angrily away. Edward was shunting in the yard when James rolled up. Old timer, fetch my trucks and be quick about it too. Like I told Thomas, James said to Edward, you're so slow and out of date. You need to be replaced, Edward. This made Edward sad, and he sadly went back to work. James was racing down the main line. It was a beautiful day, but James didn't know that it would all go wrong. I don't like the way he talks to Edward. Yeah, he's so rude to him. We don't like rude, Miss Boys. I have an idea. We can do it at the hill. James started going up Gordon's Hill, and as he started going up, the trucks started their plan. Hold, Hold back. back! James was straining against the troublesome trucks, and then something jammed and he stopped altogether. Henry came to James's rescue. Thankfully, I came to your rescue and not old timer, right, James? Right. The trucks didn't like this either, and held back even more, to the point where Henry was straining too, and then his cylinder gave out. He could go no further. The train was stuck on Gordon's Hill. I'm calling for Edward, said the driver. The engines groaned. Edward was still shunting in the yard when the foreman came up to him. Henry and James are stuck on Gordon's Hill. Can you help them, please? I'll try, said Edward, and rolled away. Edward soon got then buffered up to the back of the train. Are you sure you can manage? asked the guard. I'll give it a good try, said Edward. The train was ready. The guard blew his whistle and raised his flag, and Edward started pushing them up the hill. Henry and James were amazed as Edward pushed them up the hill. And they rolled smoothly down. The trucks caused no trouble at all. The fat controller was waiting for them at the station and he had some stern words for James and Henry. I am greatly disappointed in you both. You two have said nothing but rude things about Edward. I am very displeased. Hopefully today you've learned that Edward is a very reliable asset to the railway and he will never be replaced. He soon spoke to Edward. Well, John Edward, you've proved yourself today as a really useful engine. I will arrange for you to be repaired, so you're in tip-top condition. Thank you, sir, said Edward. The old engine was really worn out. Thomas came to take Edward to the works. Well, 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 you did it again, old-timer, said Thomas. Edward just smiled. He knew James and Henry had learned their lesson. There would never be any more talk of Edward being replaced.